What's going on, folks? It's your man Jay, and I'm back with another video. So I have uh, Zero, Zero Lemons version of the MagSafe. Now you can grab a two pack of these for 36 bucks, and they're also having some kind of coupon right now where you can actually get it for under 32 bucks or something like that for two of these. So you know, Apple's cost a lot more. So third party companies are going to bring out their versions, and Zero Lemon is in fact done there. So this is called the Zero Lemon Magnet Wireless Charger. It's compatible with MagSafe chargers. And um, it's fast charging. It works with the iPhone 12, 12 mini, 12 Pro, 12 Pro Max. It works with all the iPhones. So we're going to crack it open here. And show you, this is what you get in the box. Obviously, you got some manuals and things like this uh, that, that go along with it. Now, I'm recording with the iPhone 12 mini. So I'm going to use the 12 Pro Max to do this test. Uh, so if there's a flashing red light... Charging pad, just unplug the USB cable, insert the USB charger again. If the wireless charger is overheating, please stop charging and take the mobile device off for a while. So they've got some clear things in there that you should probably consider uh, when buying this. You can see uh, the power there. So what I'm gonna do is, this is what it looks like. Let's get it all undone here. And I've got a, I've got a turbo charger just off camera. But first, let's just see if it actually sticks to this. So this says 15 watts max is what it's probably going to be, uh, 5 watts minimum. So you can see you'll have to put it right by the Apple logo. Now, it doesn't uh, hold this heavy phone up too well, but I did try this with the iPhone 12 mini, and it works just fine. So it's on there now, so we're going to go ahead and plug it up. And as you can see here, it is Type-C, and I have a Type-C charger here. So in you go. And let's see if we can char if we'll charge this device. There it is. It is charging. Now, no fancy animation or anything like that, like on the Apple versions, uh, but it does, in fact, work. So I could see myself using this in the car or something like that. But I have wireless charging in my cars, so I don't really need this. But if you don't have wireless charging in your cars, this is an option for you. So I, find that, I found that it has to be right in the center there. And that spot right there, that's where you need to put it at to get the actual charge. And that's okay. I haven't had any experience with the MagSafe. And this is my only experience with this type of charger. So, in fact, it does work. Uh, and looks like I'm uh, in the instructions, like I said, it's probably going to be a max of 15 watts. Uh, but that is considered um, uh, charging, fast charging. Well, on the, the compatibility, uh, max is 15 watts uh, is what, and 7.5 is going to be for the iPhone 12 and, and these devices. So this is going to go at 7.5 for charging. And again, I have no experience with the MagSafe, um, but this in fact does work every time I put it down. So um, with that being said, this will be a good addition to you. It is type C pretty much looks exactly like the uh, MagSafe from what I can tell here. Uh, and uh, this is going to be a, a nice addition. So if, in fact, you like this video, I want you to give it a thumbs up and I want you to share it. I'm just saying that there's a plastic film on here. And in there, fact, there is. So let's try this again here. Let's see how the magnet works. Yeah, looks like it's not as, still not as strong to hold this up because this is a heavy phone. But let's go ahead and plug it up again here. I might have turned off my charger. There we go. And now you do have charging. So there's a plastic film over it, just so you know. I was kind of looking at that, and I was thinking, man, let me be sure. But here it is right here. This is, in fact, the charger, and it does work. Now, um, personally, I probably would only just have this on my desk and just have it sitting here every now and then. I don't use wireless charging at all, even though I have it in my cars, because when I, even when I have it on the charger, wireless charger, it just doesn't charge fast enough for me. That's my only gripe about fast wireless charging. It just doesn't, it just doesn't charge fast enough. So it does work though. And once again, here it is, type C. This is uh, what Zero Lemon is offering. I can confirm that it does work. Uh, and the max is 15 once again, and regularly on iPhones, you'll get 7.5. And I guess that's to protect it from overheating, uh, you know, and uh, I guess that's about the only thing I can say, because on the website where you read, I'll, I'll copy the, the information about this item and put it in the description so you can read it for yourself. Um, wide compatibility, 7.5 max for all the iPhone 12s and other iPhone models, 15 watts max 
for the Galaxy Note devices and the S20s and all those. So keep that in mind. There it is, wireless charging at its best for a much lower cost than what Apple is doing. And this is the same technology ultimately. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.